Hi, this is Josh Holmes here from Alternata, and I'm here today to just do a little um, introduction for Artist Impression, which is our big show we're doing uh, this spring. Um, Artist Impression um, follows the career of an artist who I've known, Marco Caffra, who's meant to be taking time off from his career. He's gotten quite successful in the art industry, and now he wants to take time off to spend with his new family, which is you know, the sensible thing to do. But he gets approached by this man calling himself his agent, and his agent says, I want you to make me a masterpiece. Marco initially refuses, but the agent uh, pursues it and pressures him into it, until eventually Marco says, okay, I'll at least give it some thought. But the trouble is Marco can't think of anything original to create. He can't think of any new ideas, and he gets really stuck and really frustrated with himself. And the play follows the plot of this happening. And it's interesting because when I was coming up with the idea for this, one thing which a lot of people said as artists, that's anything, that's actors, musicians, directors, everything, people who are creative in that way, say that they can't function very well without a side project to focus on in their lives. Just a little something which they can just do almost without much conscious thought, which is quite common, especially amongst musicians and artists, visual artists anyway, as they really do like to create either like main work, either main bits of work or main creations, but when they don't have these things to do, they want to have a little something which is just more personal, a bit more fun, kind of a way to remind them of why they enjoy it so much, just more or less for the enjoyment of it. And we kind of see Marco's mentality go from just the idea of the masterpiece as a side project to it kind of taking over his life and consuming everything about him. Um, and this show is a lot bigger as well than what we were doing previously. It's got twice as many people as Mother's Love did. It's got twice as long running length. It's just a much, much bigger show to actor. So it's there's a lot more going into it as well in terms of casting. And you see a lot more of Marco as well as a character than we did get to see in Cynthia in Mother's Love, for example. We get to see Marco's friends. We get to see his family. We get to meet his manager. We get to get a bit more backstory about him. He's a much bigger character to play and he's got a lot more going on around him as well, especially with the other artists who are in his life. They're meant to be his friends who, after having not seen them for some time, when he meets them again, he realises how different he is to them, because he's gone off, had commercial success, and they're not the same people he was when he last saw them four or five years ago. They're a lot more pettier than he imagined them to be. They squabble, they bicker. Some of them aren't as successful as him. Some of them don't quite have that kind of professional attitude which he feels is necessary, but they are all still artists. But he wants to keep his masterpiece a secret, which also goes on to the idea of being very secretive about your achievements and your accomplishments and your ambitions. Things which a lot of people do, they don't tell people about what they want to do until they've already done it, especially particularly ambitious people who don't bring out these things about themselves, they don't bring out these projects they're working on until they're either finished or at a presentable level, which is something else which we really want to play on as well. One of the other things which we really, well, as a company feel would be nice to do as with artists is to kind of... Um, showcase as it were all the talents we've got so we've seen that we can all write we've seen that we can direct but uh, one, my co-founder Alia who you know quite well she does quite a lot of stage makeup stuff so we really want to start bringing that out so we're going to be experimenting with that a lot in artist impression as well re-seeing the different things which we can do some will be quite experimental some of them will be looking to be quite naturalistic to a really authentic level especially which is the kind of the grand design of the masterpiece which we're not going to go into tonight you'll have to come and see the show if you want to see that but I think that's just about enough for an introduction so keep stay tuned and have a good night, and I hope to see you all soon.